on the run to the first corner. No, he can't. He sat still there. It's all about Mickelson and Lebedev's as they fire themselves into the first turn. Lebedev's off the inside, down the back straight for the opening lap. Here comes Bartosz Marslik, who spun up badly out of gate number two, trying to get in a second place, but it's Mickelson. But Lebedev's in top form coming into tonight, looking good in front. Yeah, really got the bike hooked up on the way to the corner and round the first turn on the inside line. Mickelson was looking to challenge out wide, then he went defensive. He knows that Smarslik now on the inside of him is going to give him a run, but he's still looking for a little bit of extra drive on the outside. He is generating a lot of speed. Lebedev's is going to have to watch out here. Here comes Mickelson round the outside. That dirt is just beginning to work. We've seen him do this before. And look at this, it's tight. Tight as they go into the final lap here in heat number three. Mickelson working overtime. Can he get there? Whoa, what a move from him. A winner just a couple of Grand Prix ago. And that was a spectacular ride from the Danish man. Bartosz Marslik, produce a minor miracle here, off the outside. We're going to find out very shortly what a start from Kubera. That's fantastic off the inside. Here comes uh, Smarslik round the outside. That's worked nicely for him. He's in the second. Can he hit the front? Kubera's there momentarily. Kubera running nice wide. Move. Here comes Smarslik with a classic turn back. But Kubera, that bike has worked well. Really good battle out in front between the, po the Polish riders. But out in front, Kubera, the finalist last time out in Prague, looking good. Yeah, Kubera looking good, but he knows he's got Smarslik right behind him. He'll be able to hear him there now. Look, two different approaches. You've got uh, Kubera riding the dirt line, Smarslik up the inside. Kubera realised, actually, as, as early as the first lap, that he's going to have to move out. Oh! Look at this. Oh! Look at this. He's going to have to speed Kubera, oh! but he's going to have to cover that inside. Kubera on the outside, he's in trouble. Bartosz Marshall is giving him racing room, and that is a sensational ride from the outside gate. Can Kubera come back at him? No, he can't. Smarslik at his best there in difficult conditions. Very competitive Grand Prix racing here tonight in Melilla. We are underway here in heat number 11. Fantastic start from Freddy Lingren on the inside. Mikkel coming on strong. Oh, look at Lingren. Oh, this oh, tight there. Wozniak, Wozniak, Wozniak coming through there. He was the meat in the sandwich. He's come from yeah, nowhere. Frick. Here comes Frick now. Frick comes into the picture. What an opening lap of Speedway that was. I tell you what, Max Frick didn't move from the start. He almost went backwards. Looked like he reverse. Now he's up the inside. I tell you what, Wozniak's wise to that. He's going to have to move down right on the curb because he's trying to come through. That's allowing Freddie Lingren around the outside now. Here comes fast Freddie Lingren. He is strutting his stuff now. Wozniak trying to stop him. Oh, what a move from Freddie. You've got to have some guts and determination to do that. And Freddie oh, Lingren is absolutely there. loaded up with that. Then Frick rams in the side of Wozniak. Spectacular speedway here. We're on the last lap. Frick has worked overtime to come through in the second place. But for fast Freddie Lingren, that is a sensational ride. Right, here we go then. A massive race here. What a start from Wolfenden, absolutely brilliant into the first corner. Beauty's up the banking. Here comes Lingren now in the third place. Smarslik is at the back. Wolfenden hits the front. He's had a disappointing night so far. Beauty has read oh, that nice beautifully. Move. But Wolfenden, yeah, Beauty got that. I tell you what, perfect timing for Beauty for the cutback. Oh, comes now Smarslik. Wolfenden now is under massive pressure. Yeah, Wolfenden's going to come under pressure inside, outside. Lingren, Smarslik behind him. Smarslik with plenty of work to do. Oh, look at the speed he's got off that corner. Done one. I've got a feeling he's going to get past Ty Wolfen as well. Bewley may be a stage too far. Beauty out in front, looking great. Wolfenden initially away, very sharpish on the inside. Smarslik working really hard. Here he comes with Freddie out the back. Wolfenden running wide. Smarslik reads it, squares the corner off, tight down the back straight. What a speedway race again we're witnessing here in heat number 14. Proper speedway in Sweden tonight. Smarzik's looked good tonight, throws Lambert at times. Oh, Smarzik's missed it completely out of gate number three. It's Lambert who hits the front. He fires himself. 
to the front, and Max Frick coming into second place. Smarzik's a fair way behind here in third place, but Robert Lambert off that inside gate, terrific. Smarzik working hard on the outside, round the outside of Frick. Here we go again from the world champion. Yeah, it's a long way round there, but he's generating a lot of speed. He's now got himself level with Max Frick. I think he's got a chance of hitting the front, Frick. A little bit quicker around the inside on that turn. See his nose is there. He's had a look across his right shoulder. And Smarzik sticking with it. Look how close oh, to the fence he is. Oh, oh, there's no room there. Crikey! That was tight down the back straight. Fair play to Frick. Frick could have made that really, really awkward for Smarzik. He did try. But Smarzik's through in his second base. But for how long? Here comes Frick again. Oh, it's tight as they go through the final corner. But for Robert Lambert, he finishes his qualifiers off in style. Going good again tonight, here we go. Oh, they're away on the inside, Frick's there. Brilliant start from Max Frick. Jack Holder follows him through. Mikkel Mickelson makes it very hard for Dan Bewley in the first corner. Bewley's got a lot of work to do if he's going to get back in the final here in Melilla, but Max Frick, what a night he's enjoying. And Jack Holder, the Aussies are looking strong. Yeah, they're looking strong. Looks like they've got this sewn up. Mickelson really is winding on around the outside. I just feel that that dirt line is now too far. And uh, Jack Holder, he took gate two. It's always a fear when gate one statistically is the best, and you hand it to Max Frick, but this will do for him. Two Aussies look like they're heading for the final. Mikkel Mickelson in third place, he's keeping Dan Bewley at bay there, but uh, Max Frick sharp away from the tapes. What a return to Grand Prix Speedway for the Aussie rider. He's going to win at a canter here, and he's through to the final. Max Frick in the final for the first time in 2024. Absolutely nails it. Smarzik's there with him. Round the Kubera, outside, Kubera. Kubera coming on. Will he get the better of Smarzik? Yes! Oh, oh that's tight. Oh, what a move. Kubera, absolutely top draw staff. Relegates Smarzik to the back when Smarzik's not out of it. Look at Smarzik go round the outside. Fantastic oh, speedway. Beautiful from Smarzik. Look at the response. He's probably going to hit the front now. Lambert covering off the inside. And now Smarzik's just letting the uh, horse oh. as it rains. Oh! Oh, look at that for a move. Tell you what, he could come out of this corner in front. Bartosz Smarzlik is the front. Robert Lambert tried to cover it, but the world champion just about hanging on. Look at now, Lambert's coming back at him. Oh, this is tight stuff. <laughs> Sensational, you're both through. You don't need to be doing that. But Robert Lambert and Bartosz Smarzlik, who has ridden very, very well tonight, they're getting the better of Kubera and Andre Lebedev's. And the world champion makes his fifth final of the season. Five out of five for that man. The grand final in Manila. Three lights on. Oh, what a start for Frick. Oh, Smarzlik. Smarzlik's there, and he's gone wide. Very wide indeed, Frick. Oh, here he comes. Here he here comes. comes. Roaring round the outside, Frick. Oh, he's it. gone back. Look at that. Oh, Smarzlik fires himself to the front. Lambert's coming through in the third frame. Frick hits the it's front again. again. Oh, oh, fantastic <laughs> Lambert Speedway. Can you believe it? I tell you what, Smarzlik, he was so committed there for those opening two, two corners first lap, but he got both wheels very close to going over the line coming into that corner, uh, turn one on the second lap. So it's going to be interesting to see that again. But Max Frick is going to keep working that inside as his only opportunity. Smarzik's got the bit between his teeth. He wants that first win of the season. Smarzik out in front. What a moment for him. And the context of the World Championship with Jack Holder back in fourth. He is going to pull further away in the championship chase. This is a defining moment in the championship in 2024. The champion is the champion in Sweden tonight. What a performance. He had a dreadful draw. Two gate fours and a gate three. He picked up huge points from there. Brilliant, right. And Bartosz Smarzlik back to his best tonight. And look how he celebrates. The team will be overjoyed with that. By his standards, it's been a long time coming this year. To round five before he wins one, but boy, did he win that one. What a ride. What a ride with Frick. 